Hey folks, and it's the same day as from the Miocin video, and now we will go to the Cambrian location for some Cambrian fossils, hopefully trilobite, at least one. Everyone is getting ready. Yep, 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 same crew, same everything, and yeah, let's roll. This location is in the middle of the forest. Protection from mosquitoes is crucial, they tend to be extremely annoying. Protection from mosquitoes. <laughs> That's the spot. Not very impressive, but we will deal with it. <laughs> it's not one of the easiest locations to look for fossils. We need these Cambrian sandstones. Issue is that 99% of these rocks are small and hard to split. Also, this Cambrian sandstone is very hard. We used shovels, hammers and other tools to get the biggest rocks to split. Hopefully, we will get some rewards for the efforts. I bet that people who are into fossils know quite well which period is the Cambrian, but even those who are not into fossils possibly he hear the expression the Cambrian explosion. Cambrian explosion is the event when paleontologists started finding first complex life forms, from which the most popular are the trilobites. They emerged around 530 million years ago at the beginning of the Cambrian period. And this location is the Upper Cambrian, approximately half a billion years old. Super exciting place. After a few hours of smacking, this is the first find. It belongs to Lukas. And yeah, this is a cephalopon or in other words, the head of a trilobite. This head belongs either to Isafaniella or Kingaspidoides family of trilobites. These were the blind trilobites, which haven't evolved eyes yet. The specimens on the pictures I'm showing are exceptionally preserved, the best museum quality pieces. What we can expect is exactly what we found. Half a billion years is crazy amount of time, and it's a miracle that we are getting to find even these cute orange pieces of the long extinct animal. Maybe it doesn't look like much, but this is one of the oldest trilobites that is possible to find, very rare location. These are from Cambrian period, basically up to half billion years old. So even a small piece is quite important and rare. And yeah, these are maybe not pretty, but these are very old, so let's keep looking. And I also got that, it was right here. This specific orange color. And they didn't have eyes, that's interesting. I will take this, but <laughs> it's not very fancy. This one, there is multiple pieces. There is a ass probably, and this is probably either head or ass. But also, there is thorax of another spe specimen inside. So this one will go for preparation. And there is a for the long time. Yeah, for <laughs> the long time. And it's possible that uh, if it's an ass, then there, maybe there will be more of it inside. There you go. Interesting very location because it's just a forest and there is rocks everywhere under the soil. Not big rocks, so it's not very comfortable to split them. Not a problem for someone. <laughs> One more head. Nice orange color. I need full one though. And one, one more rock and this one I will take home, even though I'm not taking partials a lot. This is nice cranidium of a 
health a billion years old color white nice orange color and yeah i will take this one home at least one piece because the rest i decided not to take so yeah quite honestly i'm starting to lose my hope to find a complete trilobite if i will find it uh, then good if not this is probably the end of the video but not the end of the series because tomorrow we continue so see you later guys i am back home and yeah i only took one rock with me it's a bit of a shame that i only found one decent one i'm a little bit of a slave of aesthetics and this one piece uh, did ring a bell for me to take it with me it is a nice piece and yeah i did cover it with paraloid already and there is something else in this rock there is i'm quite sure that in here there will be another piece of a ancient trilobite almost half a billion years old this is crazy but this one will have to be uncovered so yeah i was thinking if i should take this rock with me but now when i did take it with me i'm happy that i did because yeah at least i have something to show off uh, from this trip we spent there like four hours maybe even five and barely any finds so yeah, uh, the video is over, but the trip is not over and the next video will be out next week and we will visit once again the Vonian sediments and in that next trip we will find a lot of fossils so that's gonna be an adventure, a lot of corals and brachiopods, just a hint, so yeah, thanks for watching and see you next week guys, bye!